I mean, if you want my two cents. He doesn't. And I'm sorry, you are, are you family member or? It's complicated, I'm her roommate now. And he's a terrible communicator and he's really, I, I don't know if there's a medication you could give to Nick that would help me be less stressed or if, when I'm kidding? around. My boyfriend and I broke up right before quarantine started. Kick him out, you have to get him out of there. I can't kick him out, where's he gonna go? He has like $12. So I don't have a job. It's like I'm working for you living in this apartment just well, by- that's not new. I'm reading for like weird foreign animated shows. You know what Eddie Murphy did, Shrek. Yep, yeah, he got paid millions of dollars exactly, for that. Exactly, but you're not Eddie Murphy. I gotta get out of there, man. I just can't be around her anymore. We've been trying to create really strict boundaries. You know, he's in the other room. We hardly interact. I think the best way to get over somebody is just move on to the next thing. You know, it really lights a fire under me, though. There's this guy trying to get with my ex-girlfriend. Yeah, there were parts of it where we broke the social distancing rules. Would you mind stepping back a little bit? We're trying to keep a six-foot distance thing going on here. Oh, no, no, we're, we're good. I, I'm 6'3", so I know what six feet looks oh, like. Oh, no way. Yeah. Should I relax? You never take responsibility for yourself, and you act like you don't even care about me half the time. I don't think you want to get back together. I think you're just too lazy to move out and go start your own life. I'm not trying to change anything with us. For a while, it was like, I love you so much that it's impossible to not hate you. It's gonna be dope, man. I'm super excited. I'm like, I don't know what to do, how to feel. We maybe did have sex, but other on another hand, maybe we didn't. I don't know what that means. Yeah.